This is a very quick screencast. I'm going to show you how to make a draw a picture into an essay question using the Poodle repository. So this is our Poodle demo course, and I'm going to show you uh, using the Poodle demo course how we would do this. So I've already created a question. I've called it the simultaneous equation question. Let's quickly have a look at how I've written this because it's quite important. It's just a standard essay question uh, with a question name, uh, question text, feedback. But the, ref the response format has been set to HTML editor with the file picker. So now let's actually uh, log out and log in as a student and do this co do this uh, quiz. So let's show the login here. Uh, so we can log in here as any of students from 01 to 050. Let's choose 25 because it's a good number. So I'm about to test for 25, let's try 26. And here we have our math quiz which contains the question that we just saw. And let's attempt the quiz now. Alright, it took a while to load, but our question is uh, loaded up now. Our quiz is, has begun. And so we have here a standard text editor, HTML editor. Let's type in something. I won't actually go through and do anything serious because I'm not a math teacher, so I just embarrass myself. But let's uh, have a look at the main part of the what I want to show you, which is how to insert a picture into your essay question. So we go find and upload it an image. And here we have the Poodle repository, two items from the Poodle repository, the Poodle snapshot and the Poodle whiteboard. Click on the whiteboard. We'll be presented with a whiteboard and we can draw anything we like onto that whiteboard. So one plus one equals two. Two plus two equals four. Great. Let me hit the save button. Okay, and now that image has been transferred over into Moodle. Click next. We just need to drop that into our essay question. If we just pull it down a little bit, you can see there that we have our initial text and then we have our image that has been added there. Uh, and then if once we save that question, it goes through uh, just like any other submission uh, and the image will be there when the grader goes to view the question.